Columbus, Indiana, Reach Healthy Communities. Our plan for health project is related to Go Healthy Columbus. So there's really three strategies we're looking at, um, are really kind of harboring our bike and ped implementation team or coalition. Um, we've had some ups and downs, so we're really using this to get that going again. And we're doing that through a project, doing an east-west connection, looking at intersections along the way and the bike and ped ability through them. Um, and then we're, we're working to try to get a relationship with our Indiana Department of Transportation on how the intersections that they have authority over in the community impact the walkability or bikeability of the area. And then the last is really the whole Go Healthy Columbus is a public awareness campaign related to creating a community, community design that promotes healthy, active living. So we really saw a weakness. We've had, we had some projects previously come up where the naysayers won the argument and they said, no, we don't want it to happen, and it didn't happen. So we've spent a lot of time and energy really trying to get the public aware of opportunities, why you want to build communities for active living, and then where we have opportunities along the way. So we had the Walk Institute, or Walkable and Livable Communities Institute in town, and they really did a lot as well, garnering public input. And then we've really tagged on the stuff that already existed, like we, we've always planned Bike Month, and this year we had our first annual Walktober. And in, in October alone we had nine articles in the newspaper related to bike ped. So it's really, really helped create the buzz. I'd recommend garnering your personal relationships and meeting with people one-on-one. -on -one. We have had some serious political turmoil in Columbus, so the Plan for Health grant has kept us at the table through the changes. But sometimes people will tell us, you know, that person's not on our side for this because of that political turmoil, but we said forget about it, we're going to sit down with everybody and talk to them one-on-one, -on -one you know, and get, get real, figure out where the relationships are and where we can meet on common ground. And so I think that's been really beneficial that we were able to keep momentum despite some of the other things happening. And we were able to find out that some of our biggest supporters are ones that people said would not be. So I think that's been a big, big help, really big help.